welcome or welcome back to my channel didn't even put that there um my name is Alyssa if anyone is new here but I just finished my yoga practice I just did like a 10 minute one and i'm about to get into the shower but i decided to just start filming regardless if i think i'm doing something that is worthy of showing y'all or not like i decided that i just want to start filming the reality oh that's my friend oh my god oh love my friend i met her while we were on a walk um, I'm about to have breakfast and shower, so I'm gonna put my, I'm gonna put my tea to heat in my rice cooker, and I'll show y'all what I mean by that, um, and I'm also about to go shower, and then I'm gonna go outside to edit a video, what was I saying, oh yeah, perfect timing because I get to tune into myself and kinda do my practices, dedicate myself to my practices, um, because I feel more comfortable doing that when I'm in my own space. Um, so, yeah. I get to do that. And um, me and my partner are actually having a date today. So, we're going to do that later as well. And I'm so excited. Yay! I'm so excited. So, so, I'm in the shower now. Well, not in the shower, but I'm in the bathroom. And I'm about to put my higher self playlist. And yeah, that's it. Let me start running the water, get in the shower, and then I'll get back to y'all once I'm outside with my breakfast and my tea, getting some work done. I'm currently outside, there's a little trail, not a little, there's a huge trail of ants. So every time I walk out here, I'm like, I just got out the shower. I just got out the shower and um I'm now gonna have breakfast out here and I'm gonna have my tea and I'm gonna edit and I'm actually editing on my phone um and then I send it to my laptop and I finish editing on my laptop but yeah let me show y'all the scarf and how it's coming out so far not how I planned but also like exactly what it needed to be i'm still gonna wash it and um yeah i still have to wash it but let me show y'all kind of and i still have to put like the embroidering on it but let me show y'all so this is what she looks like this is the leaf one leaf um i did more but like see how they look they're not that that there but anyways um this right here i have no idea what it is but i don't know if y'all can tell well only from this side actually you can tell i don't know if this is the leaves like these, all this like brown part but it literally looks like two like a lion and a tiger like it literally looks like two tigers together like that's one right there this is the other one right here and these are this right here is their bodies so literally like not how i planned but like that is so divinely aligned oh my god love and then i put some more leaves here but you can't really tell and with the hammering this is what happens so on these little stuff i'm gonna re-sew it um and i'm gonna put like a bunch of little like embroidery patches you see how i left it so ugh, literally sucks but that's okay because it was a first try um and i'm also gonna like embroider little stuff on there or like sew it with like little different colors um to make it a little bit more colorful and yeah my outfit is so cute i was kind of going for like okay kind of it's giving like i don't know what it's giving but i know what it's giving you know what i mean um so i wanted to wear this on top oh i have some paper here but i wanted to wear this on top because it was kind of giving like um 
if y'all know who Carla and KB are, she always wears like these little, what are they called? Why do I want to say like leotards? I don't know, but she always wears these things that are like this when she goes to Pilates, and I'm like, that is so cute. So, I did it myself. This is just a tank top that's actually like, it goes in right here, and I just put it like that because I think it's so cute. So, yeah. And these are biker shorts, but I wish that they were longer. I have black tea and arnica tea. So divine. Mm. I always have my cereal with some water. As y'all know, I don't drink milk. So I always have my water with my cereal. And it slaps all the time. Like people want to downplay it, but it be hitting. <laughs> Today is Sunday, and my intentions for today, like during my yoga and my meditation, were peace, harmony, love, and ease. Moon? What the? My cat just came from the other side of the- <coughs> He just came from the other side of the wall from the neighbor's house. Boy, what is he doing? What the hell? Oh, what that girl right there? so it's a while later and we actually finished our date like an hour ago but let me show y'all what i ended up drawing um yeah it was just like an intuitive channel drawing um so divine period love and I ended up, I, well, I painted and my baby was drawing, but yeah, it was so much fun. We chose each other's colors and period, love. It was so cute and I'm just so grateful. It's literally, literally everything that I said. Four of, uh, four of swords, meaning like it's like a slow day, like kind of just gonna take things easy. I'm not gonna really do too much today. Just chill, recharge my energy, ground, tune back into me. The four of pentacles, it's like no longer feeling scared, no longer holding on to things that are no longer serving me. Like, there's no need to fear. Trust and believe in you shall receive. And literally with the nurturing. Like this is Mother Earth, Universe, God, nurturing me. There's no need to worry because the universe is here with us. The universe is gonna take care of us. And this is us receiving. Literally about to write that affirmation down. Like trust and believe in you shall receive. On my journal. And look at what's right here. I literally didn't even put that there. Literally. Literally elevating. Cash money just hit. And we're receiving. I'm receiving. I'm open to receive. Period. 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 Easy for us to receive. It doesn't even have to be hard. You don't have to experience anything hard or difficult before you can receive. There's literally a frog right here. 
literally period that's a significant message for me all i see is money bags money bags money bags money bags money bags all i see is money bags love one one money bags i also wrote down the money code which is five two zero seven four one eight thunderstorm but instead of thunderstorming it was literally sunny as fuck like it was hot so i don't know i don't know well i'm letting out my cat right now and i'm also heating up the water let me show y'all um one second water is being heated um i'm gonna let that boil and I'm gonna go fill up my Brita water as well. song on loyal by summer walker and literally it keeps giving like that energy of like like any bullshit any bullshit that people are like trying to portray on you or anybody or even if you're the one trying to portray any bullshit on anybody like whoever the accounting part is like they're not worried about you if you're holding negative energy then that's just you perceiving your own negative energy like what why create your own reality to be negative especially when someone else don't give a fuck about it or about you like i'm worried about your shit today no it's probably dirty but i know like the song is like i'm not worried about your shit today no like i'm not letting anything bother me I'm gonna live a vibrant life because that's what I deserve to be living and so it is. Love 111 as I say that. And the part, the next part says, I guess I'm on loyal, baby. I guess I'm on true. Oh, see, it didn't work that much. I said this one maybe, right here. Y'all see that little effort? 
whatever. That's okay. Literally that part is like, oh well, you can perceive if I'm unloyal, you can perceive if I'm this, you can perceive if I'm that, you can perceive whatever it is that you want to perceive. I'ma just let it be because it has truly nothing to do with me, period. You know what I mean? Like, oh, it's starting to sprinkle. I get my baby niece's clothes. Y'all, so I've actually been missing my sister and my niece this past week that they haven't been at the house. Like, actually, like, although I'm so happy, so happy. I have my own time. So it also it like cut off. But although I, ha I have my own time to myself, which I'm so grateful for. Um, and I'm so glad because I literally needed this. Like I needed the, I needed to allow myself to actually tune in and allow myself the space to actually be doing something. And when you're around like family like my sister and my niece like there's kind of always like the commotion going around whether it be my niece screaming and playing you know whatever so i feel like whenever that's the case there isn't a lot of that quiet and simpleness to be able to tune in um to my own energy because because i'm a healer i feel like I can empathize with people really quick and like pick up on their energy and I really need to start like calling back my energy and protecting my energy and keeping my energy to myself while being able to hold other spaces for other people to express their energy without taking it on. You know what I mean? I'm gonna step on the grass for a little bit. Um, I'm actually gonna sit even though it's just been watered. <sighs> Hi, Mola. I'm talking to the chicken, chicken, chicken. Still here at Ralph. Rex you know pulled play? out the battery, and that's just not what you're supposed to do. So we told him to put it back, and the baby's still crying. Currently making my 
dinner-ish because I ended up making a lot of oatmeal and I got full and then once I got hungry I ended up finishing my oatmeal but I was going to have more soup and um oh you're falling I was gonna have more soup and uh what is it called grilled cheese but I did make the grilled cheese and I ate it already but I was also prepping for breakfast tomorrow so I was just making some uh huevos revueltos and um I guess my soup ended up going bad um which makes sense because I made it a bit ago um and which makes sense because yesterday I had some and my stomach was rumbling gumbling and tumbling so anyways I'm just gonna have the huevo revueltos right now and I low-key burn my tortillas but it's okay and yeah and i'm also gonna cook some pasta while i'm at it just so i can prep for tomorrow so yeah while i wait for this to boil i am gonna start eating and i'm gonna also be finishing editing my video which i actually finished editing it everything is done now i just gotta upload it to youtube and finish like all the credits and stuff um so yeah i'm gonna do that and while it uploads i am gonna be eating and um also i'm gonna be finishing watching the movie epic that i didn't finish watching a few vlogs ago so also it's now like later in the day my video is gonna end up going tomorrow i mean uploading tomorrow why is it dirty it's gonna end up uploading tomorrow because me is fucking the background it's gonna end up uploading tomorrow because it is a longer video and it's just taking a while to upload but anyways um i'm about to ground i actually have i actually found this like meditation for like centering because i just feel like centering myself actually my baby inspired me um so i'm gonna have some chamomile like literally just a small amount because i've smoked like a whole bowl before of like chamomile and i feel like for me that's just like too intense and like when it comes to smoking or anything like that what i look for is more so of just like calming kind of like cbd but i realized that when i smoke a full bowl of chamomile it's just like too overpowering um for me just for my liking so having a little bit love one on one um but i'm about to go to the bathroom and oh also i wanted to show y'all what i do because y'all see how bright this light is um oh let's do green so what i do is i literally get a piece of clothing and i literally just oh i should probably get on the bed for this and i literally just put this over and y'all see like uh, maybe you can see maybe you can't but it just gives it like a different hue of like um green so i'm gonna set the energies i think i'm gonna light some sage cleanse the energy get it right and then i'm gonna go into my meditation and my yoga let's go to the bathroom first
truth is unshakable, that my foundation to myself, my praise to myself is rooted in all its vitality. Because how deeply I love, how deeply I laugh, how deeply I am and feel. how 
how triggered they feel when I share my love. Puts me in that position of seeing if I should even love. And I understand that that has been the story. I see that other people's triggeredness or fear when it comes to how much I love doesn't have to be the dictator of how much I share my love. frequency like it was just playing 
I literally needed that so badly today. I love how it cut me off before. So, yeah, I love you guys. Make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. Because if you don't, if you don't, the cool is gonna get your legs when you're sleeping. I'm just kidding. I love y'all. And y'all are gonna be protected when you're sleeping if you like, comment, share, and subscribe. And so it is. I'll show you.